Well, hopefully the president's getting a little bit of downtime. He's back at Mar-a-Lago, likely for the rest of the evening after spending the day just south of us in the Keys, talking with those people who are combating trafficking, drug trafficking and human trafficking. President Donald Trump took aides on a day trip to West Palm Beach, including the Secretary of Homeland Security and its chief of staff. Trump says the visit to this federal anti-trafficking agency was an education. We can't emphasize enough, not only drugs. The drugs are a big factor. But you look at human trafficking is worse than it's ever been in the history of this world. And who would think in its modern day age? After a briefing, the president thanked military leaders and emphasized the difficulty that comes with fighting trafficking online. And they're using very sophisticated equipment and they use the Internet better than practically anybody uses the Internet. But it was the support Trump received in the Keys that caught his attention. I hope you saw the crowds uh, in Key West. They've never seen anything like that. It was really very inspirational. And as the motorcade returned to Mar-a-Lago, more people turned up to welcome the president back to Palm Beach. While the president acknowledged that technology does have an impact on human trafficking, he also took that opportunity to push for his border wall between the U.S. and Mexico. For now, we're live here in West Palm Beach, Whitney Burbank, WPBF 25 News.